All right, let's do another demo. In this case, we're gonna use that same web application that I showed you in the last clip, and we're gonna deploy it to our Azure App Service again, but this time we're gonna use Visual Studio. All right, here we are in Visual Studio. We've got the app open, and we're gonna deploy it up to our Azure App Service. So the part of the app we're gonna deploy is simpleapp.webui. So we're gonna come over to this in Solution Explorer, right click on it, and from the context menu, we're gonna choose Publish. Now you might've heard people in the DevOps community saying things like, friends don't let friends right click deploy. And I can totally get on board with that. If you're gonna deploy an application in production and you're gonna do it relatively often, you probably want to use something like Azure DevOps and do a pipeline to deploy your application, or you're gonna use something like GitHub Actions to deploy your application. But for simple demos and for simple development kind of stuff we're doing here, this is totally fine. Don't worry about it. So right click the project, choose publish, and the first option under the target list is Azure. So choose that and click next. Our app service is a Linux app service, so I'm gonna choose deploy to Linux, click next, and Visual Studio is gonna to talk to Azure using your credentials and show you the list of app services. So in our case, it's under this one, so Bende App Service Demo, select that and click finish. It sets up a published profile, a configuration that's stored here on our machine, and if we open up properties, we see we've got a published profile right here. So the information that's in this is what is shown here. Now to actually do the deploy, we're gonna click on the publish button. And here is our application running up on Azure. So to make that work, what we did, right clicked on the project, chose publish, and followed through the wizard to get to this screen right here with our publish settings. And then we click the publish button and that's it. Pretty easy. Next up, let's talk about Azure App Service Security. 